Okay, so what's up guys? I just found out that a musician named Joe Egan has passed away, and I've actually listened to a, quite a bit of their music. Now, you may not know Joe Egan, but you probably heard of his friend, Jerry Rafferty, or Gary Rafferty. You know, Baker Street, the, the saxophone song, you know? And he's he died back in 2011, but Joe Egan just died not even three weeks ago. I just found this out last night. I just look was looking at him up, and it said he died July 6th, which kind of sucks. And their band, I believe they had a band before Steeler's Wheel, but it was a local band called the Humble Bums. But, you know, it's really, you know, it's awful, but he was 77 years old, which is all right. And he was born in Paisley, Scotland, like his friend. And they are known all around Paisley even today. And yeah, this is unscripted. This is my straight reaction to this. And um, this is like one of the deaths that kind of surprised me. Because I didn't expect to look him up and he died recently, you know. I didn't expect that. But he died on July 6th, so that's about... 20 days ago 19 days ago so two more days would mark three weeks or three more days actually or no two two sorry i don't know how to do math but if you heard that song you know i'm stuck clowns to the left of me jokers to the right and here i am stuck in the man it's a good pop song you know but it, it there i listen to all of Steelers wheel and at least they're all of their first album it's mostly folk songs that is kind of that song that they played called Stuck in the Middle with You and Star. Star is another popular hit of theirs. It reached number five. Um, Stuck in the Middle with You reached number five, and it's pretty cool. Anyway, rest in peace, Joe Egan. Rest in peace, Jerry Rafferty. And yeah, hope you somewhat enjoyed this. You know, it's kind of sad, you know. And yeah. Joe Egan died on July 6, 2024. Rest easy, bud.